World Snooker Challenge 2005 and 2007, they are two games, are more of a simulation game, or try to be at least. The cover says that all of the 100 real-life players in the game were animated using motion capture. And while you can see the great animations on the characters, the balls look like some pictures that grow and fade. They don't look like balls, nor really give you the impression of being balls. When they move around, they look rather just like some pictures. And you can tell that because the reflection on the balls never changes. The white point that is supposed to be a reflection remains in the same spot, no matter where the ball moves on the, from the light source. But aside of the balls, it's nice that you can play every official tournament of 2005 and that the presentation tries to imitate a TV broadcast. And in most cases it succeeds. And another nice feature is the character creation tool. But how does the game play? It's pretty okay, you can tweak your shots in detailed ways, you can adjust the power, English and the angle, and the physics work well for the most part. Overall the game is still fun and if you watch a lot of snooker on TV then you will love this game as it has 100 real life players and you can make your own character and compete against them so you can imagine the fun if you're a snooker fan. And even if you're not, you're still going to have a lot of fun in the game. Okay, and now even if the games look the same, feel the same and play the same, there are some slight differences between the two. And I'm not talking about just the manuals. From what I've noticed, 2005 and 2007 have different match types. They still have the same number of match types, but for example 2005 has doubles and snooker plus. Two match types that don't appear in 2007, but 2007 has 9 ball and 8 ball, which 2005 doesn't have. Other than this, I haven't spotted any significant differences, but I'm not a snooker fan, so maybe I didn't notice them. But anyway, no matter the differences, both games are fun to play.